up guys another uh, episode or another section at least of car rebuilds I don't know how these will blend together but uh, somehow I'll get them together so got a new haircut today yeah I didn't put any product in it because I knew I was gonna come home and play grease monkey anyway we got some parts in I got the uh, new fenders I got the new fender flare and uh, back there somewhere in a box is the new radiator and uh, before we do the radiator though we're gonna start tearing the front end of this thing apart as you remember I got these frame rails that were damaged. Um, hopefully it's just the front section. And then I bought an entire Jeep Wrangler frame off of a burned 2012, I think it was 2011, 2012 frame. There it is right there. Um, it does have perfect front rails extensions. So my plan is to um, get the front of the Jeep apart and then start uh, figuring out where we're gonna splice this thing in now. Mopar says you need to splice it in right here above these, this little um, bar, but my bar happens to be very bent. Um, so what we're gonna try and do, I think, is we're gonna try and take it apart right here and then slide it back into the main frame rail, see if we can't slide it in, adjust it a little bit and get it squared up, give it a little more beef to, to weld to. Not a welder, I'm have one of my buddies do it, but yeah. So tonight we're gonna try and get the radiator off, we're gonna try and get the condenser out of the way, Oh, power steering pump has to come off. Um, at least it has to be uh, put out of the way a little bit. So we're just gonna start and see how far we can get with getting that stuff taken apart. So I've got most of the stuff off. I pulled the radiator out, um, working on getting some of this, uh, actually gonna take the power steering pump out, um, disconnect all electrical wires. I'm working on getting all this out because the frame has got to be cut right there and right there in front. So you can see, I can really tell now how bad it's bent. Looks like the, the free stops right there, hopefully at those bolts. Uh, hopefully we can uh, just cut it out right there and save the front, but let's keep working to get this stuff out. Hey, I'm back working on the Jeep Wrangler and made a lot of progress. Um, haven't had a lot of time, so we didn't film a lot of it, but uh, we got the frame put back in place and uh, I'm going to start working on the axles, get the U-joint replaced tonight and the uh, front axle seals. But uh, yeah, here's a look at where we're at. radiator cover got the uh, body mounts back installed and uh, it's lining up pretty good had to use some straps to get those guys to line up and get these bolts to go through but for the most part it, everything looks straight it's lining up everything's going into place so that's awesome thanks again dude hey guys how's it going today L late afternoon and I've got a special helper today this is my son Watson, otherwise known as Tapu Coco, the famous Tapu Coco on YouTube. Sure. And uh, he's gonna be helping me wash some Jeep parts today. So 
Um, we're on the final assembly of the Jeep. So we're just gonna take a lot of the pieces that uh, need to be final assembled. We're gonna wash them up, bumpers, um, the uh, in, inner fender flare liner, whatever that's called. And uh, I'll be working on the uh, ABS system today and he's gonna be doing some parts cleaning for me. So yeah, pretty excited. Uh, we're so close to getting to see back together, as you can see. Missing the fender flare right there. Everything's on over there. Just got a little, some touch up paint underneath the, the body. I actually ended up um, getting under the body, scrubbing all the, the dirt and stuff away, wire brushing it, and then I'm putting some under a coating on it just to keep it from rusting uh, as a rust inhibitor. So I'm pretty excited. It looks clean, looks great. Um, we'll get this thing down off the jack stands today. Hopefully pull it out in the street and get a good look at the final. Got all the stickers today to replace um, that were on the fenders and uh, hopefully we can get, uh, get the rest of it going. So what do you think? Yeah, let's go. Let's go.